Hey guys, what is up? I'm sorry I have not been posting much videos, so I hope you guys can forgive me. But anyway, I wanted to introduce a new idea, because no one did this what if yet, so I'm doing it. So what if Deku was the Locust King from Gears of War, and I think I messed up out my spacing. Yep, I did. I'll fix that later. But anyway, guys. So after the war, the Queen realized that the King was freely wounded after the first battle. The king was incredibly strong, but did not count for the gear's hidden weapon. It shot the king multiple times, but in doing so, mortally wounded him. He was unable to fight for years, so the queen decided to put him Arsaceus, into a sort of trance or sleep. After those years, the war was just simply forgotten. The world restarted, as if nothing had changed. As humanity began rebuilding itself, this is a time when Cork started appearing. Of course, Corks are not the only thing evolving. It was the Locust King. He each time he sensed a, each time he sensing new powers, his body began to go certain changes. He was healing faster and faster. Till the time when All Might was no longer in his prime. And he and he was no longer how should I say this? Strong. No, a strong. Deku awoke from his long slumber in his abandoned castle under the ground beneath. Hmm. Well, what used to be the Gears of War headquarters is now Japan. Because the war, people had to make sure no one ever remembered the war. So people made sure the dates were mis misjudged. Or reversed to 2000s, but really, it's actually 3,282. Because they didn't want to spread panic, because they'd say, you're that far into the future. However, as Deku was getting up, he put his hand on his face, he's like, say, like, what the, hell, what the hell am I? No, not, not that. When is it? Is the war over? And of course, Deku looked around the room. However, he find nothing but with its like skeletons. Nothing but dust. However, he decided to take a piece of his flesh and he found a locust pit. Deku yeah, as, as soon as Deku ripped off his flesh, his flesh began healing itself. And Deku said, Huh, it seems I have appeared to have abilities. Interesting. But I must find my queen. This locust hive should store still information regarding the pack. Steku is the king. He's able to control all the hive mind. He's more powerful than the queen, but the queen is just. I don't know. Yeah. When Deku pushed the flesh into the pit, the pit collapses on itself, and three locusts appear. All of them, when they're all coming out of the pit, they bow to Deku. Purging his loyalty to him, as any locust should. Deku turned around and saw on his throne and said, What happened? Deku said with a very, very loud tone. Locust said, Sir, you've been asleep for 3,000 years. Deku got out of a scene and said, 3,000? 
us was to recover in the next two years what happened. And then one of the locusts, the second locust said, Well, sir, since you are asleep or in hibernation, things changed. We lost two queens. Deku shout out from his throne and said, Two queens? I only married a only married her. And they both of them said yes, but she had a daughter. Deku sits back on his throne in anger. And he said, I had a daughter. And all the locusts said yes, but she's dead, long gone. And Deku puts his hands together and says, I guess that I missed the family reunion, I guess. However, Deku is still kind of pissed off by this. Because he was supposed to be leading the locust to victory. And without this queen, let's just say he just feels lonely. So Deku tells the locust if there's any more pits or anything else down here that could be useful. The locust said, no, sir. I'm afraid that there's only a few pits left. Deku said, very well. Deku ripped more pieces of his flesh and gave it to the three locusts. And Deku said to them, find the rest of the pits and bring me my army. The locust said, yes, sir. However, when when Deku, when they're both when they're all about to leave, Deku said, "However, we're not going to war the surface world yet. During my slumber, I've I sensed I've sensed change in the world above. So, when you return, make sure we have a locust that can have as a blacksmith." Or a weaponsmith from the old war. Because our the weapons that we have <laughs> should prove pretty fatal to them. However, this will be your task, so do not fail me, my soldiers. Locust oh Locust said we won't fail you, sir. Deku said good. As the three of them leave the castle. Deku sits up from his throne and walks to his room. He sees that there's a there's a few things that's really old and cobwebs. And Deku put his hands together and says, Damn. It's kind of weird. He said, I have this strange power. I'm stronger than I was before when I was the king. I feel like I know every answer I have, but still it wasn't be, isn't enough. Deku said, I must find a new queen or a replacement, to be more precise. Deku thinking about if there's any even white royal blood left in this century. So, of course, Deku is, yeah, he's a human form. Of course, he's the human form, but anyway. When Deku, when Deku hears his stomping, he immediately goes to back to his throne and sits on there, waiting for his army. The three locusts that were naked are now fully clothed with armor from the old war. And the three locusts said, Sir, we brought you what's left of the army. Deku looked at them and just sighed. It's like, I expected a bigger army. Lucas said, I know, sir. But we don't have much pits. And the other hives are far off, far from our reach. Deku said to them, Listen, I'm giving you more of my flesh, but 
to awaken these hives. But I want you to make sure we don't attack humans from now on. Oh, well, Locus said, why? Deku says, I, well, since, well, to be precise, I explained to the three Locus that I've brought back to life. Mm hmm. Oh, that's right. I haven't re-established the hive mind connection yet. His Deku is in slumber, and the queen's connections with the hive are, like, haven't really can reconnect with the old hive, so Deku slowly just snaps his fingers, and all the hives are connected, and all locusts understand what Deku mean, what our Deku, what the local Deku means. Deku decides to look up above the surface world and see what's changed. So Deku decides to take off his royal wear, and tries to find casual clothes, which some locusts found, while exploring the surface. And Deku told them if they were spotted, they had permission to kill the humans, but make sure they didn't see the body. And that's when Deku had the idea, and gave this locust, gave locust the idea, don't kill them. Bring them down here and turn them into locusts. And all of them are having a genius like that. And all of them. And Deku said, this could be my greatest plan ever. <laughs> As Deku puts on his regular wear. Okay, you a uniform. Because Deku looks like he's in his 18s. But he's actually in his 20s. Plus locusts. Because Deku doesn't age. He's mostly immortal. As Deku begins walking down the street, he begins trying to find a suitable queen to mate with. Or more precisely, just to have a queen again. As Deku looks around, he doesn't sense anything. However, he passes by someone named Juno. When Deku sniffed her scent, she smelled of kind of royal blood, but kind of tainted. And Deku decided to take her, but he wished to know where she went. And Deku followed her without her noticing. When Deku followed her, Deku hid behind a wall, and he sees where she is. Juno's at Juno, Juno, Junior High. And, uh, hold up, guys. I want you to say, guys, if you really like this what-if, please smash that like button if you do. Anyway. I have an announcement, guys. I am going to get back to the video. However, this is my friend's what-if, so you may want to see him. So, anyway. This, guys, I've been working on a secret project. I didn't want to tell you guys, but... We, I have a server with some other friends. We are called this, the Four Kings. If you guys like it, I'll leave I'll leave the subscription down below to the invitation to the server. However, you guys have to guess which one is me. You guys literally have to guess. It's not that hard. Anyway. You made it, guys. I think something just fell. Nope, okay, good. Anyway, guys, that's all I have to say. Anyway, guys, I'll get back to the video. As Deku sees where she goes, Deku just... just tries to act friendly towards Juno. Juno. As Deku, when Juno leaves, when school is done, Juno wonders why is why is someone following? She she wonders if something is following her. And then when Juno Juno leaves school, Deku just try to pass by, 
and they actually bumped into each other. Deku did that on purpose, but he tried to make it where he didn't actually mean to. To gain her trust or get understanding how she will react. Juno said, hey, what the heck? When Juno looked at Deku, she looked at a handsome young man. Juno kind of blushing at this is like, what's your name? Trying to like, trying not to look at his face. Deku gets up and says, my name is Deku. What is yours? What is yours, lady? And Juno says, my name's Juno. And Deku says, oh, hello, Juno. Do you want help? Do you want a hand up? Deku reaches, reaches his hand for Juno. Juno grabs it as Deku's pulling her, her up. Without without knowing it, someone spilled like uh, water on the ground, and Deku slipped and he didn't do it on purpose. And as Deku was pulling Juno up, Juno fell onto Deku's chest. And they're both about the earth, but they're both staring at each other. Almost two inches of lip length. And Juno got excited to get off of him faster. And Deku's like, okay, did not plan that. However, Deku snapped out of it of him being nervous. And Juno just just crouching on him. I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I almost kissed him, I almost kissed him, I almost kissed him. Deku seems to say like, Hey, uh, uh, are you okay? Juno turns around. She's like, she's like taking a deep breath in. She's like, yes, I'm fine. What's, your, what's your number? They was like, excuse me. And Juno's like, mm, that's too far to me. Stupid, 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 stupid. And Deku said, um, are you all right? She says, what time? Juno's like saying that. It's like, um. Thank you for helping me up. See ya. Juno now has a crush on Deku. And Deku amazed by this. Like, huh. Well, didn't expect that. But I'll tell you one thing. She is incredibly interesting. I'm actually going to take her as my bride. Oh, the, the moan she will have tonight. Oh my goodness. I can just imagine Deku saying. As Deku realizes, he says, hmm. Oh, I guess it's time to go. Of course, Juno's friends did see Deku's face, and they took a picture of it. And everyone online is going insane how handsome this guy is. However, people don't know that he's a locust. Because locusts are actually mortal. And the thing is, guys... If so, if one takes you as your bride, you will actually probably get the ability to be immortal if you drink their blood. However, they can only be killed by some type of, like if their hive's destroyed, or a queen has fallen. That means the hive connection is completely severed. However, Deku's recommendation is different because. Back then, his body was, well, it was immortal, but the Gears had a specifically made weapon for the king that would neutralize him and make him stop healing. However, over time, Deku slowly, slowly building up the immunity to it. And now Deku is completely immune to it. And if you guys are saying, yes, Deku can go, can go to toe with one for all, and even in All Might, even in his prime. So All Might can not stand a chance against Deku. Because I think Deku can actually amplify his own power. If he sees the person's quirk. And understands it. But he can actually manipulate it. And combine it with his power. Well, not actually take it. But he, if he like. If someone like does a demonstration of punching him. He examines the power. And he thinks of the right input. And that's when the ultimate strike will begin. Here you guys. Holy shit.
sorry guys, I'm like really tired today. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you did, smash the like button. I'll talk to you all later. Anyway, I'll link my Discord into this, so anyway.